Hi, I'm Cassandra, the Joyful Artist. In this video, I'm showing you how I rework a painting that I felt was a bit lifeless and inspired by the action paintings of Jackson Pollock and Damien Hirst and the colour field paintings of Helen Frankenthaler, I've started to add more emotion actually, bubbles of joy inspired by a series that I created during lockdown called Think Pink and Think Pink is all about coming from a higher vibration than some of the low fear driven energy, guilt and shame that is being propagated through the world currently. As you see I'm working intuitively many times people think this is a really simple process but it takes years of um, study of art and colour and understanding where to place your colours. It may look random but while I'm working from my heart I can guarantee you it does take a lot of skill to work in this way contrary to what many people may think. But then I'm a person who loves to paint with the curiosity and joyful wonder of a child relax, as Picasso Laurie. once said it took him years to learn how to paint like a child so you can see me here just throwing oh, down some paint so splattering it if you like um, dripping using sticks so uh, coming straight from my diluted pot of paint and it, honestly I can tell you it's super fun it did take a lot of patience because mm -hmm. it's actually mm -hmm. you have to go you have to take a lot of time when you're working small, like small pops of bubbles of joy. You'll also see I'm working on a couple of other pieces um, that I had originally painted too. And again, they were just too, I don't know, they just didn't feel emotionally evocative or fun. In fact, one of the ladies who saw these finished pieces named one of them fun. So I hope you find this video fun too. You'll shortly hear my partner coming in from mowing the lawns and we're having a conversation about what's happening on the property. And you see, I don't have to paint in seclusion. It's quite nice having people come into the gallery and talk with me. I step back, I see us, step back, step forward. It's a going back and forth to and fro process. And you'll see in this video, I'm singing away. Um, I think I've got another colour now. I've changed to my favourite colour, which is a magenta. Uh, I sing away. I tell my painting how much I love it. I'm talking about freedom, how we all want to be free. My partner was watching this with me briefly, and he said, gosh, what drugs are you on? And that's the thing. I'm on a happy high with my art. It's so restorative. And that's what people who've come along to my workshops have found too. It's like a um, ecstasy drop away from all this negative press sweeping through the world. It's just a moment in time where you can transcend. That's why, you know, the art, the spirituality of art is to transcend your worries. Um, I think it was Picasso again who said, art washes from the soul the dust of everyday life. just a few little people 
Tell me what caused me car. You caused me car. And little bubbles. Thank you. 